I believe this because I live this. There's no elected official closer to the people than a sheriff. Everybody's lives depend on the decisions that you make. The sheriff is the top law enforcement official and the top elected official in the county. I would guess that most Americans don't necessarily understand the level of autonomy that sheriffs have. If we had a good sheriff, I wouldn't be running for office. Law enforcement at its core is incredibly political. We have an opportunity to have a conversation with the first black sheriff. So I've been where you're sitting. What do you see your office doing to reach these young people and let them know you don't have to fear us? There's a lot like you, and they want you to be sheriff again. You've got that right, and I'm one of them. Well, I guess my objective is to get rid of Chuck. Well, I don't like to mention my opponent's name. The change from Chuck Jenkins to Carl Bickle is the biggest swing that I can help make in our local area. Of course, this plays into all the other drama that's playing out in American politics right now. USA! USA! Americans are being killed by people who are in this country illegally, and Americans have had enough. And as a sheriff who takes my obligation seriously, I'm going to do everything I can to protect them. Seal the damn border. Build the damn wall. The current tenor of the politics across the country has taken a turn that we never saw coming. This is probably the most important midterm election that we've had in a very long time. And I'm convinced without what you're doing here today, every county becomes a border county. Thank you, Mr. President. Well, oh, I think we're going to win. The need is greater now than ever with the sheriff's office. We got to win. Say it again. We got to win. All right. This is my livelihood. This is my career, and everything's on the line.